Hey, Monte. Um, how did it feel tonight, and, and how do you feel in general uh, coming back from your hamstring and obviously having a rest day yesterday? Where are you at just health-wise? Well, I'm, I'm good. You know, I feel like I could have – they needed me to play like 30 minutes. I would have been able to do that easily. Uh, as far as the hamstring, we still doing work with it and things like that, but I'm very confident in it to explode, go to the rim and play my normal game. So um shouldn't be an issue going forward. So – Brandon Cristal. Well, so Monte, do you want to play the same type of minutes Sunday just to kind of keep the rhythm going, knowing you're going to have time off before the playoffs start? No, I mean, I mean, my rhythm is back. Even in Charlotte, you know, I was so worried about just my time and not playing for a minute. Rhythm was cool. I know where my shots are going to be like tonight. You know, this was my second game in so long, and I was just out there, felt like myself and wasn't afraid or second guess anything. So um, I'm not sure what my minutes will look like against Portland, but as far as rhythm, I don't think this last game don't make me play no different in the playoffs. I feel like it is what it is. I know what to expect. You know, I've been through this, you know, a few times now. So um, it's, you can't really Im imitate playoff basketball in no way. Leonardo Torres. Hi, Monte. It's Leonardo Torres from Peru. Congrats on the win. Monte, almost at the end of the season, what is the balance you can make about this, this season? Um, you mean overall or like what you mean? Overall. Um, you know, it's just been a, you know, a tough season, you know, especially short season, a lot of games, and we were able to have, you know, 22 road wins is huge. Uh, I think we got guys, you know, resilient who always know his next man up mentality. You know, as you see, guys are stepping up in a big way. So uh, the season's been up and down. Guys are fighting through a lot of injuries, but um, we've been able to uh, withstand that and, and stay on top in the West. Vinny Benedetto. Hey, Monte, I think Coach Malone said you had some, some friends and family there in attendance tonight, given – all of, all of the stuff that's going on this season, was, was tonight a little extra special for you? Yeah, for sure. It's always special. Uh, my family, um, you know, that seen me and watched me and raised me uh, when I was young, always dribbling the basketball around the house and everything. For them to come see me play live instead of TV is always special. Um, I can't take those moments for granted. You know, having my mom there with my jersey on, you know, that always – I always used to sit down with her on the couch and, you know, uh, watch, you know, LeBron – play and, you know, his mom would have on his jersey at games and I always tell my mom, like, I'm going to get there um, when I was really young. So it's definitely an uh, accomplishment and a blessing at the same time. Brian Blackburn. Hey, Monte, I wanted to ask you about the play-in tournament. Uh, Portland is going to be playing for their, their lives, trying to avoid the play-in tournament on Sunday. I just wanted to know your opinions on it this year. What do you think it has done for the league? And, and what are what are just your opinions of it overall? I mean, I'm used to the old school way. Um, you know, like I said, growing up watching the NBA it wasn't really a playing game. But I mean, I don't really got no comments on it. We're not in this, so I, don't, I just stay away from it. You know, it's a touchy subject throughout the league. You know, none of my business to really talk about. So, Mike Singer. Hey, Monte, you've obviously started next to Nicola uh, before throughout times this season. What makes him work with whoever is around him? Why does it seem to thrive regardless? Um, just, I mean, he's not like one of your superstars where, you know, he just got to score, got to score, got to score. You know, you know, if he had a chance to just get 30 assists, I guarantee he would do that before he get 30 points. So, um when you got a guy like that that's willing to pass to anybody, you know, if you open, it's just so much easier and so much fun to play with. Um, you know, he'll tell you that. So I think that's why it works for everyone. You just got to cut, get to the right spots, you know, and he makes you look, you know, a lot better than you are. You know, he makes me look good all the time with back dirt cuts. So I like, I like playing alongside Nicola, you know, we definitely grown on and off the court, just relationship wise, you know, he tell me, you know, be more aggressive here and stuff like that. But just hearing it, you know, from your MVP or your number one guy telling you to do things and be more aggressive, he got confidence in you. 
it makes you take your game, you know, to another level. And I respect that, you know, from coming from the calling a guy like that. Vinny Benedetto. Hey, Monte, it seems like there might be some some parallels between kind of what, what you went through um, and what Marcus is is going through being four year college guys, not the highest draft pick, not all the minutes your rookie year. I guess what have what have you seen from him these last last week or so? I mean, I, I you know, I see myself all over again with Marcus. Um, he a guy never complain, always on time, bringing stuff to the plane, being a great teammate, you know, not complaining moan and bitching about, you know, not playing. He come to work every day, straight personality, straight to it, watching film and working his tail off. So, you know, God, basketball guy is always watching that, you know, when you do the right thing, you know, it pays off. So when you do stuff behind the scenes, I'm happy for him. You know, all this stuff he's doing out there is no surprise to us or me. You know, he do shooting competitions. You know, he'll he make 30 in a row. So, I mean, we know he, he could really, he could really fill it up. All right, that'll do it. Thank you, Monte. Yeah.